<laughs> I don't know too much about trucks, so. Neighbors say I'm getting too much paper. I got Pinch look, bitch, I got that cat in my pocket. Yeah, pinch look, and I'm doing the dance. Off the lot, yeah, pinch look. Nigga, this a hot bust. This shit, I ain't coming with no pinch look. And I got little friends with me, and he ride with a 30 clip. Nigga, don't get your ass flipped. Fuck where I get your ass dipped. I'm clear with these niggas, they all get killed. Yeah, pinch look. A nigga shiesty with them sticks, so don't get popped, nigga. Get your knock, nigga. What's up, you guys, man? It's your boy, Real to Real, man. Back in here with another video. Hey, man, say, man, hate, man. It's your boy, man, Real to Real. Y'all already know what it is. Now, first of all, today, I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of mad about two different things you guys two different things so the first thing i'm mad about is <laughs> this company actually had the nerve to send me this box saying that this is my electric step bars for the ram so y'all know how pissed off i am right now at this this size box it's supposed to be electric step bars. So I gotta take this back to FedEx, ship it back out, do all this return, can't get the money back until like five to seven business days. Y'all don't even understand. Then Amazon shipped my other package to the wrong location. Now I gotta wait and get a refund from them too. They said they can't just send me out another one. They have to um, go through the process of doing the return, then I have to reorder. Man, and I said I'm, I'm just gonna wait on all my money to come back before I get to ordering some more stuff. And this time, I'm gonna call and I'm gonna reach out to the company. I'm not ordering anything else offline, man. <laughs> Cause I hate not being able to walk in somewhere and just go grab my stuff and just go. You know, this is kind of a big time headache. Ordering some with your money, then you gotta wait on your hard earned money to come back in five to seven days, whole weeks. So, hey, it is what it is, man. But we finna go jump in the Ram because uh, I'm gonna head back up here to the dealership real quick. And then I got some few other things to do, some knickknacks and stuff to do. Um, but you guys just come along with me. My truck goes in the wrap shop February 7th. So uh, yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned, man, for what's to come for that. And my wheels, my wheels gonna get done pretty quick too. But uh, I'm gonna catch you guys in a minute, man. Peace. Yeah, so I, I wanted to get off in the truck and get everything started first. Um, I think a lot of people um, took my yesterday video out of content. Um, so, you know, when I was explaining everything, I wanted to explain it to people about, um, you know, about saying what wheel size I should go with or anything like that. Um, that was you guys opinion and criticism I wasn't talking about anything dealing with you guys so um, you know calm down you know for some of the people that probably got offended by my yesterday video that video wasn't about none of my supporters none of them not even not even the ones that be in the comment section trolling it wasn't about none of them you know what I'm saying it was about something else so um yeah you guys if you guys took it the wrong way sorry about that but um no sometime before you type man you gotta listen to the whole video because sometimes most people skip through it and don't end up knowing what i be talking about so you can't skip through it and then um think that i'm talking about you guys you know what i'm saying so um don't ever think that if something come out of my mouth it's never about you guys yeah i love criticism i asked you guys opinion on the 26s or the 28s and I did also get the size wrong when I told you guys uh, I had said 26 by 12, but no, I'm doing 26 by 14. Um, that's the size I'm gonna be going with on the vehicle, uh, 26 by 14. So um, yeah, man, um, I just think that's gonna be right size, 26 by 14, probably with a seven or eight inch lift. I probably do an eight-inch lift just because I just want to sit up a little extra bigger, and um, if I could put some bigger size tires on it, then I would some 38s or something, uh, other than the 37s. But um, we gonna see, we gonna see. Man, he got that uh, AMG C63 joint right there, the the photo version or the one I was gonna get. That's the photo right there. Yes, sir. 
But uh, yeah, this battery is going dead on this camera, but we're gonna run this thing all the way out. Cause um, you know. But no, I just want to tell you guys, man, I appreciate y'all. I appreciate the love you guys been doing on the channel. Man, I apologize to a lot of people too. Um, cause I do be posting uh a little late now. You know, but it's all on the grind, man. Like I told y'all, I don't be wanting to miss a day of posting. So sometimes I might just post late, real late videos. So that's why I say you guys gotta have your post notification turned on because um, you never know, man. I post my videos around about eight o'clock point all the way up until like one in the morning. So at that point, just be looking out for my videos around eight o'clock all the way up to one o'clock in the morning, you know? I will always um, post a video every single day. I'm not gonna miss a video. So you just gotta be looking for it. You gotta have that post notification bell turned on. And uh, like I say, I, man, I appreciate all my real supporters, man. Y'all don't know how much y'all are a blessing in my life, man, my real supporters, you know? Um, and a lot of people, um, a lot of people got it confused too. Um, it was one video where I had a rant, you know, about some um some merch or whatever and the 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 case was you know i never said i'm complaining or something about people not buying merch no um one thing was that i said was a lot of people ask for my help a lot of people ask for me to shout them out or can I do a free collab with them? All that type of stuff. Um, numerous of things. And then I go to their page. They don't post. It was a year ago before they post. Or they skip three months before they post the video. I was saying that, hey, well, have you bought some merch from me? You know, are you supporting? Are you buying merch? You know, nobody is supporting me in that way. You know what I'm saying? To where I feel like I have to reach out and grab somebody and pull them up. You know what I'm saying? But if you supporting the campaign, I see your name coming through. I see you making orders and stuff. Um, I see you ordering merch and all of that. Of course I'm going to help you. Um, you know what I'm saying? If I ever see you or if I just feel like shouting you out and shouting your YouTube channel out because you support me so much. That's when... You know, I really, really support. You know what I'm saying? When some somebody is help supporting on my end, you know, you can't just ask for free handouts all the time. It's not gonna work. You know, I put a lot of money into my grind and a lot of money into my YouTube. I'm heavily invested into my YouTube, and it goes to show y'all. Y'all gotta think about it. I pay my car note. I pay for my wife car note. I pay for my mom's car note. And I pay for this truck car note now. That's four car. That's four cars I pay for out of my pocket. No help on that. None. Not a zero. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, when I say help and support by buying merch and stuff like that, um, don't get offended if I'm saying buy some merch or something like that. No, that just means that's just support. So I feel more comfortable with supporting back. You know what I'm saying? So. The world isn't free, you guys. You got to understand that. You got to realize that, man. But I do help people on the daily free. If you watched my video yesterday, I helped the guy, man. He was like, man, I'm an inspiration in his life. He had his camera out, like ready, rolling. So that means he was grinding. That means he was serious about what he's doing. Most people are telling me, oh, man, man, I look up to you, man. I'm grind I'm trying to grind just like you. But they ain't sparing the moment. They not using the moment. They ain't got their phone out. They not recording nothing. You know, they just telling you this and that, but they only want to put their channel out in your, your camera and not have their own video going. I don't look at that like you grinding. So of course I'm not going to want to help all the time. But at the end of the day, you're supposed to always have your camera out. If you come around me, have your camera out if you're a YouTuber or I'm not going to take you serious. It's just that, you know? But um, man, we're going to get up here to the dealership where I bought the truck from. And um, I'll catch you guys in a little while, man. Peace. One hour later. Okay, okay, you guys, man. We made it up here to the dealership. Uh-uh. Got them two Rams over there. Looking good. Got the 
2500 round right there too. That one look good though right there. I think they just got that one. I didn't see that one last time I was here. Let's see what they got going. How you doing? How you doing? Hey, What's going on? Much. How are you? All right. What's going What's on, going on fella? Oh. Okay, y'all. So I, I took the owner. The owner is running me up here to the Dodge dealership. Uh, he's just trying to make sure um, everything on the truck is normal and everything like that. See, that's the type of dealership you mess with. Some Somebody that want to make sure everything is good because like I told you guys, some the reason why I got this truck at so much of a good deal is because um it was a trade-in he had just traded it in the the person and you know that was just one of them things right there but uh hey how you doing all right yeah but this that's definitely you know a good truck like i fell in love with this truck Yeah, I actually know a lot of guys. I, I know a lot of guys up in there. Yeah. yeah. They have some um, round trucks and a lot of those Jeeps out there. Guess those are the new ones. They got a lot of grand. Cherokees and all that. A lot of I got a TRX in here. Oh, why are they up in there? Let me go in here and look at this real quick. While we up here, man, might as well get the footage. No reason why we shouldn't. Let's go up here and check this out. How y'all doing? Yeah. Oh, copyright though. God dang. Five seven liter right there. It's lifted too. Look good. That's the grill I just ordered too. Or it's a little bit different than that. I don't know. That might be the one I ordered. TRX orange. Oh. Yeah, the Hellcat motor in there now. Oh, we're gonna be copyrighted. Oh man. Yeah, so let's get up out this copyright. <laughs> I ain't trying to get copyrighted today. Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. Yeah, let's get out this copyright music. <laughs> yeah, way too much copyright. Way too much copyright going on. Got a Jeep out there. Go through that drive. Go drive Jeep. Got a lot of rams and stuff out here. But, I like that blue on there. But it's just a little too bright for me. For me. As far as a truck. Trucks, I think, only look right in like certain colors. I don't know why. I just always felt like that. Like they just only look right in certain colors. That's that extended 2500 big boy right there. That big boy right here. And I got that big boy right here too. Don't get, don't get to thinking otherwise. Yes, sir. But, um, yeah, we're bringing Big Boy Ram. Big Boy Ram up here today. Come back to the dealership. You know what I'm saying? Man, this truck just looks so good. Yeah, I didn't even know that these lights was on the mirror until like a couple days ago. Like, it, it's, it brings out the truck so much more. Because you see them both on at the same time. I also got a, um, I'm putting LEDs in them. I'm changing them out so we can make them clear. No, I can't have that yellow down there. No, sir. But yeah, you guys, so I had saw the, the other grill and I was like, man, I might as well change the grill out since I was gonna have to paint it anyway. Might as well put the new one on. 
you know. Right, so. Oh yeah, uh, I'm with him. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you. Oh, oh yeah, you can be in my movie. It's okay. You know, we show everybody love. <laughs> Somebody might know you and recognize you on this, so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, yeah, you might be a billionaire and I don't know it. Okay. <laughs> How you doing? Good. All Thank right. Uh, it is normal for it. Well, anyway. But yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah, I appreciate him. He said everything is normal, and uh, everything is good. Because I can see all the cylinders they go at the same RPMs on the big computer. I'm just trying to get my feet wet. Then I get something smack brand new. <laughs> I don't know too much about trucks, so. This is my first truck. First truck. I got a lot of mud tires up here. Huh? You went over there to get the coat, get, you know, get the you for get us instead. Yeah, you're good. Okay. But okay. uh because my foreman's got the same truck. Okay, okay. And it so, does it? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. That's what he's telling me. He said even every once in a while. You may feel when it's going to Is shift. that a four-wheel drive thing or a two-wheel drive thing? It's a two-wheel. Okay, okay. So, so when it's in two-wheel, it'll do that. But when it's in four-wheel drive, it probably won't, huh? Yes, but don't be driving around in four-wheel drive. No, 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 no. So I only got the four-wheel drive just so I can tow my Hellcat. Yes. Yeah, so, okay. But other well, than that, wheels, you have to do it four-wheel Okay, drive. so for my people that's on here, you just told me something. So what should they know about driving it in four-wheel drive from versus from driving it in... Two so, wheel. driving it in two wheel is going to be all on dry paper. Okay. Right? So when you go to a four wheel like an auto, uh huh. So like that's when it's wet or raining kind of got or something. Precipitation that uh -huh. is coming. So if you were to drive around in that to give you increased performance traction, but if you go to a four low, it'll feel like your engine's all binding up if you're on pavement. Oh, okay. And it happens a lot. Guys will come in and they've never had a four wheel drive because electronic four wheel yeah. drive shift. And they'll come in saying something's wrong when I'm okay. turning. Yeah. And it feels, it literally feels like oh, you're, you're, okay. you're being okay. hugged real, okay. real tight and yeah. you're trying to break out uh -huh. of it. So. Okay, makes sense, makes sense. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank well, thank you for the knowledge. Thank, thank you for you the knowledge. I appreciate, appreciate you. you. What's your name? Matt Johnson. Na Matt Johnson. Shout out to Matt Johnson, man. Up here at the Dodge dealership in Plano. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. No bill for you. <laughs> no, no. I just wanted to make sure everything was good. You know, you told me if I had any questions, to just come back to you. Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. you know, I think you have to back it up. Uh, I do. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It looked like a fence was around there. I know, but it is close. I yeah. A lot of times. So. Yeah. So you guys, everything, man. Shout out to my guy. Once again, I'm clean. He I'm came clean. through. <laughs> he was clean in a way, you guys. No, no I knew money. it wasn't nothing like crazy. No money out of my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Not today. It's okay. Not today. Not today. <laughs> Not today. Not today. <laughs> hey, y'all know how that go. <laughs> you know, you you can get a brand new vehicle and this will happen. <laughs> Seriously, you can get it off the showroom, you know, and something could happen, you know. So, yeah. So he it's mentioned just a, the uh, the uh, he's not come out this thing. Uh huh. The, the forcing them to shut down. Really. Yeah. Let's Let me put this seatbelt on for this thing get the ringing. But um, uh, yeah, you guys, man, it goes to show you, man. Go to dealerships that actually care about you know the people, and uh, just there to look out for everybody. You know, make sure you you let them know where to find you again. Carpoint. Carpoint DFW. What's the address? One three three four one Floyd Circle. Yes, sir. Make sure y'all hit him up. Y'all need you a truck or vehicle. Y'all see, hey, he jumped right in with me to see if it was a situation. And uh, I really appreciate it because, you know, you don't get that all the time. You know, okay. some people, when they get the money, they run from you. <laughs> <laughs> but no, we, we say him a headache today and I can get on with my day because I did not want to drop my truck off. <laughs> I've been loving it. I have. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I've been loving the truck. So, uh, man, shout out to him, man. <laughs> but yeah, if y'all in, ever in the market for uh, trucks, specifically diesels, but he do be having V8 sometimes here and there. Trading. But trade-ins, yeah. yeah. Um, but other than that, he get only diesels. So if you guys looking for a truck, make sure you hit him up. And uh, yeah, catch y'all in a minute.
Peace. A few moments later. Yeah, man. Make sure y'all definitely, man, go to them Google reviews, man. And let them know, man, that we just really appreciate them, man. That guy is one cool guy. And, um, man, you do not meet dealerships like this. Like, you do not meet cool people like this all the time. I promise you, you don't. Um, that guy is so energetic. And he's just so good to people. Like, he didn't have to do that for me, you know. This truck don't have no warranty. But he was going to fix it for me, you know. And that's that's one of them things, man. You, you got to care about your customer. Um, and he definitely do that. So y'all go give him a, another five star reviews if y'all haven't. Um, Carport DFW. Um, make sure you guys do that for me if you can, man. I, I really appreciate it. But now we off um, into the sunset. Let's see what we finna get into today. Um, man, I was. Um, yeah, but the situation. Okay, I gotta go by a FedEx office. I gotta do that first. I'm gonna go by a FedEx office and uh, go ship this uh, thing back through FedEx. And um, yeah, go from there. I gotta wait till my money get put back so I can order my step bars for this. But my car, I mean, my, my wheels ain't gonna be ready soon, soon. So, you know, and then I still gotta get the truck wrapped and stuff. So, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Uh, we gonna see. I'm out a whole lot of money right now in this truck. I'm not gonna cap to y'all. I'm not gonna cap. I'm out a whole lot of money. And if anybody told y'all ever that trucks are cheap to do these bills, they out they mind. I ain't gonna lie to you. My Hellcat is cheaper to build than this car. I mean, than this truck. Way cheaper. I'm not gonna cap. <laughs> you know, I'm not no capping person like that. But, you know, I do mess with y'all sometimes, but I'm not no capping person. And I'm going to tell you the real, but this truck stuff is expensive, man. Like, it's expensive. You know, I knew what I was walking into, but I didn't know. I didn't know all the way. You know what I'm saying? But like I say, man, y'all know I grind. So, you know, it's, it's entertainment for you guys. And you guys got to know, man, that I'm putting out a whole lot of money for y'all. Putting out a whole lot of money, like... It got your boy nervous, but hey, if you around here walking comfortably, that means you ain't doing something good in your life because you got to be uncomfortable to make millions. I'm telling you, you have to be uncomfortable to make millions. <laughs> hey, ex Steve Harvey. But uh, yeah, I'm going to catch you guys in a little while once I get to my destination. Peace. Dang, he flipped this truck. He was going around so fast. Dang. Two vehicles on there. They over with. See, that what happened trailing these vehicles. Dang, he's sick, man. God dang, and it's only his fault. Like, that's a that's a bad week right there for you. Golly, that's why I be so nervous. That's the reason why I bought this truck and trailer, y'all. That's the reason why I bought this truck and trailer. I cannot see, see that happening. Oh my God, man. That's crazy. That is crazy. That is crazy, bro. Man, I hope he all right and good. But I know he is, I seen him in there, but he looked depressed like crazy golly man but i'm headed up here to um drop this package off at fedex and then i get back with y'all in a minute okay y'all man i just left out of uh fedex and um i did want to say this man if anybody want me at the car show um this year uh anybody want to book me for their car show hit me in my dms on my instagram uh, real to real underscore nine zero one or real gang underscore one You guys can hit me up at either one of those or you guys can hit the link in the bio um, To a man my manager or um, You can send an uh, email My email is in my description of my video uh, Yeah, 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 you flying it's raining crazy nut 
going that fast coming up through a parking lot for them. Some people just nutcases, man. Some people don't need vehicles, for real. And be wondering why it be so many wrecks and accidents and stuff. Because of people like you in this Jeep. People like you in this Jeep. Exactly. Yeah, I had that camera on you. Because you would have hit me. We would have had a problem. We would have had a problem. Do we have a problem? Hmm? <laughs> like on Don't Be a Menace, boy, they better stop playing with me. <laughs> hey, but we headed up here to Audio Zone real quick, and then I got to head over to Corleone and uh, get some business squared away with them. One eternity later. Let him do that. Okay, y'all, man, I know I didn't discuss this with you guys, but I was actually getting my tent done over on the vehicle. I know you guys seen it. But it wasn't dark enough for me, so I end up going with that murdered out 5%, man. And I tenant the wind chill, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, I couldn't go without that. I'm, we right up under the light, too, so that's the only reason um, y'all can see that little handle up in there. Because it's real light, though. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want it too dark, so I wouldn't be able to see. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all subscribe to my boy Billionaire Brent. Know what I'm saying? Billionaire Space Brent on YouTube. Yes, Man, his channel going crazy. Y'all seen him pick out the new truck. If y'all didn't, know what I'm saying? His new truck is right here. And make sure you go uh, over there and watch the videos because he got a lot of stuff coming for it. Know what I'm saying? Can't show y'all everything. Can't show y'all too much. Know what I'm saying? Just go over there, you know, just give y'all a little taste and show y'all the color. Because yeah. I, I seen a lot of people in your comments like, yeah. oh, Rail sent us yeah, over here. Yeah, we see, see you billionaire, hey, Brent. Appreciate that, Rail gang. Yeah, appreciate definitely, real, definitely, though. man. Go over there and join the billionaire boys club, yeah, man. I'm you trying, know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm trying, trying. So yes, I got sir. A video, hey, I got a video coming in the next day. Uh, We're I trying get. to keep my boys consistent, man. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Rail, hey, he's staying on me, so I yeah. got Yeah, and I, my I boy going to be coming with that merch, too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He gonna be coming with that, that merch, y'all better stop playing, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I ain't had be looking step, forward to that. Step. Yeah, I know, y'all be looking forward to that, man. He gonna make he gonna make his uh, first drop on the merch. Yes, sir. And y'all seeing it firsthand right here on my channel. Already. He gonna have all colors all right colors. there in that, you know what I'm saying? So, hey, springtime, I'm gonna be ready. Springtime, yeah, yeah. be ready. Yeah, my boy gonna be in there, man. But yeah, man, the, the truck came out dope, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know. I should have put five over the tent that was already on there. That's what I did. You did? Yeah. I took I mine off. So I, just five all the way around. I know. I took mine off. I stripped oh. mine. I should have just did it right over it. That's what I did. I wanted to go. Yeah. yeah. Now that's what I said. Nah, bro. I ain't. I don't need it too dark. You know what I'm saying? I don't want. Yeah. I don't want too many problems with no police. You know what I'm saying? You know. I just wanna. You know what I'm saying? That back darker than dark. That's got to be double, bro. I know, but you know what? Oh, that's probably 0%. That's probably limo. But you got to remember, though. You sitting up hot. So yeah. So when, when, when police pull up side you or anything like that, they, they not going to look. Can't, they can't yeah, look. Yeah, they can't look. You know what? So it's a little different. But dang, I should have put that. that I should have put it right over that, that mug, though. I ain't going to lie, because that back just murdered out. You ain't seeing nothing. Not nothing in that mug. You, hey, you'll test it out tomorrow when the sun come out. You'll be like, okay, let me see how. It, exactly. It is kind of hard to see in the, in the nighttime. I know. I know, right? Yeah, that's Yes, sir. This thing coming together. I'm still pissed off, bro. They, they ain't send me my electric steps. Them folks sent me a wire harness, bro. Man, bro, had hey. me going. Boy, I knew it was too that, good it to was be too, true. It was too good to be true. Too good to be true for that price, bro. So now I gotta wait for them to refund my money. So that's gonna I'll, take some more days. I was just about to tell you what I found out. I gotta tell you off camera on my truck. Yeah, man, but that's <laughs> that's crazy, man. Then I supposed to went to Corleone and put some 26s beside it so they can see what an off-road wheel look from that regular wheel that I put up there. You know, oh, okay. they they going off the looks of that um uh, street, street wheel. wheel and no, nah, you can't you can't they compare that. It's not a three-piece wheel, and it, 26's off-roads are much bigger than a regular uh, car wheel. So, for y'all, you know, y'all can know, you know, down in the comment section. But it's a look that I'm going for with this truck, so I'm going to go with the 7 or 8-inch lift. Well, my guy said the 8-inch, 
know what I'm saying? So I can put the um 27s on here. 26 with the 27 tire. 37, 37. 37. I keep, yeah, no, I even yesterday I said 26 by 12, but I'm getting 26 by 14. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking at either 22 by 12 or 24 by 12. I know I Why are you getting by 12? Because that's what it recommended with, 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 with mine. Man, I just gotta check the offset. That's, that's, it's gonna stick. Forget that. I don't want my stick all the way. I know, we gotta stick out. What the heck you talking about, bro? You gonna put no, bro. You going 14, bro. Don't go no 12, bro. That's just a regular tire like that. that ain't, no, that ain't that's a regular that. rim. That's 12 right there. That's a nine. Bro, that's 20 by 12 right I there. I know. The tire might be 20 by 12, but the rim might be a 20 by 9 or 20 by 10. No, the rim is a, a 20, 20 by, by 12. No, it ain't. I promise you that. I promise you that. Bro, it's sticking out. I promise you. The no, rim the, is sticking out. No, the tire bubbles over. I know, but the rim still sticking out outside this. Yeah, because that's the offset. But that, that, that's got to be a 20 by 9 or a 20 by 10. Uh, I'm you. going 20 by 14, man. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to be Jack. I'm going to be Jack. Yeah. That's, that's all we going to say. I'm going to be Jack. You know what I'm saying? Man, I love my truck, bro. Boy, I love my truck. Ain't nothing like a truck, bro. I ain't going to cap to you, bro. I'm loving this joint, bro. Y'all, if I, if, I'm telling you now, man. If you got a, a choice to get a truck, Man, get you a truck, man. Look at him. No, nah, bro, don't don't tear up my steering wheel. Man, you gotta, man, gotta, you gotta man, hold. You gotta pull that other piece. Hey, that might come off. This man, ain't that ain't gonna come off. That more strong. Boy, that more strong. I tried. Nigga, boy, ain't no hey, taking that hey, off. Boy, you need to get some steps, dude, boy. I know, bro. Hey, boy, I felt I felt the little little you shock go up my leg. Right, yeah. <laughs> Shit. I'm like, nah, I can't be jumping in and out this mug though. But yeah, I'm gonna get me some of them leather seats on uh, things. I'm gonna order them. The uh, leather seat. The skin. Uh, yeah, the skin. skin. Uh huh. Yeah. Yep. Yep. I'm gonna order them. So. Nah, front and back. eBay. Somebody. A lot of people be taking them off and selling them on eBay. I I seen it for this. Yeah. Get a whole kit for like three hundred dollars. Yeah. Mm hmm. I'm gonna see. Find some ones that black, probably with the white piping or something. Know what I'm saying? Yeah. To go with it. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. But, um, yeah, so I'll catch you guys once I get to the crib. Man, it's getting a little cold. Ask my wife what she wants to eat because I'm kind of messed up about this situation, man. Folks holding my dog on money. <laughs> but I don't like that. I don't like no banks holding my money, bro. Not when it's my money. You know what I'm saying? It's my money. Like, let me hold my money. I come in there and take it all out. Sorry, sir, it's nothing we can do now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Don't put no limit on me and then hold it. I'm going to give you my money. You gonna put <laughs> yeah, you're going to put a limit on me on mine. You got, you got my own Come on, man. I ain't in jail. Yeah, like, bro. Like, hey. This ain't commissary. Yeah. You ain't got yeah. no Even in commissary, boy, we, we tear some stuff up. Yeah. Ain't no limit. It's just we try to, pres try we to, try to yeah, preserve, yeah. you know, because we got some time to do. But, no, nah, ain't no limit in jail, boy. Hey, give me some shoes. Give me some socks, some T-shirts. Got them some ramen noodles. And I want a hundred bun, got them some chips. You know, man, shoot, give me, some, give me some juice. You know what I'm saying? Shoot. Hey, man, you got to make what you can. You know what I'm saying? When you locked up, give me some of them, some of them paper boxes. Whatever you got. <laughs> hey, 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 oh, for hey, real. Hey, hey. I know you got a square. Hey, I know. I you know, know what I'm saying? Got somebody got a square in this mug. Shoot. But yeah, man, what you about to do? Head on to the crib. Go to the crib. Yeah, man. Y'all go over there to my boy channel, man. Tell him congratulations. Yeah, you finna go edit a video, yeah, nigga, because that's what I do. Don't fall asleep. Hey, I ain't gonna promise you that. Hey, hey, hey. I, I fall asleep every I'm night on the computer. Wake back up. And I wake back up and, and post my video. I ain't gonna say I'm gonna do all that. <laughs> I say I'll score. Bro, I only get three, four hours of sleep. I go to sleep every night at probably five or six and wake up right at nine. Every day. I gotta get my beauty ready. <laughs> all right, bro. All right. Oh, jump up in this thing. Yes, sir. Oh, hold on. Oh, he was 10 there. I'm like, who got my seat up like this, boy? I'm finna go on one, boy. Don't play with me. Man. Oh, we electric, though, baby. Stop the kids out. Dang, man. It's just light. Fire. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, shoot. This mug up, too. 
Man, y'all love this truck. And there's so much space, so much room in it. Y'all just don't know. Yes, sir. Dang, I should have went double 5%, man, on the front. I should have left that tent on. Dang, I should have went double. Because I think the back is straight limo double or something. But, uh, yeah, let me get on down, get to the crib. And, uh, man, I'll catch y'all in a minute, man. Yes, sir, peace. Neighbors say I'm getting too much paper. I got a run. Peace, look, bitch, I got that cat in my pocket, yeah, peace, look, and I'm doing it there, all the lot, yeah, peace, look, nigga, this a hot bust, this shit, I ain't come with no peace, look, and I got little friends with me, and he ride with a third of clip, nigga, don't get your ass flipped, fuck where I get your ass dipped, I'm playing with these nigga, they all get killed, yeah, peace, look, my nigga shiesty with them sticks, so don't get popped, nigga, get you knocked, nigga, she popped the sand, the bitch is sleeping, sand, my coat too fast, police done see me, she 